Hey guys, welcome to my channel if you're new and if you're not new, welcome back. So today I am going to be giving my honest review on the Makeup by Mario foundation. So I ended up picking up the Makeup by Mario foundation during the Sephora VIB sale and I got the color 230. So the Surreal Skin Foundation in the color 230 and it's one fluid ounce slash 30 milliliters of product and this is what it looks like. And excuse my nails, um, I have on press ons and I'm gonna do that. That's my last step before I leave out so just excuse my nails. But yes, I have on the Makeup by Mario um foundation in the color 230 yes it's the real skin foundation and let me see, 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 see i would like yeah i would say that it's a hydrating foundation um i know like for me i have really dry skin so i personally um I only like to wear like hydrating foundations. I don't do matte products. Like I don't do matte primer. I don't do matte foundation. So I'm going to go ahead and add my primer to my face. So this is my primer. I use the e.l.f. primer. And I'm going to add like more to my forehead. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and add the foundation. So I'm going to put one pump right there and one pump right there. Okay, that was actually a lot in that pump. So I'm not going to put too much more. And then I'm going to use my foundation brush. So I use the Morphe M439 brush. This is a really good foundation brush. I love it. And I'm just gonna paint all over my face. So off rip, this color does look like way lighter than me, but look, it matches my neck. Do y'all see like how good it matches my neck? And when it oxidizes, it, it actually like looks really good so obviously as you can tell this is not my first time wearing it I've already tried it but I'm like let me just like try for the camera mm -hmm. so yes when I first put it on it does look kind of far away from my skin tone and honestly I think I could get away I think I could go a shade darker and I was trying I color matched myself and I was like trying them in the store, but I ended up just going with this one because it looked really good and it matched my neck. So you're gonna see how it oxidizes. And plus I get lighter in the winter. It's the winter right now. It's like, well technically it's fall, but um, like it's about to be the winter. Like it's fall, it's getting really cold. It's, so as you can see like, this is what it looks like. So you see how it's matching my neck perfectly. Like I feel like that's great. And like I um okay. So first, like initial thoughts, it smells really good. Like personally, I don't like scented makeup items or skincare items because I have very sensitive skin. But it smells really good. It goes on very smoothly. Like I said, it's hydrating. Um, you don't need too much. I'm a, I am a very like, I like to like use a lot of product. I don't want to say over product because I don't, obviously I don't want to use too much product than I need, but I'm like a slap on the makeup girl. I like all the makeup. Like I don't like to just, oh, let me just put a, a, a dabble there and a dabble there. No, like I'm wearing makeup. Like let's beat the face. So I like to wear a lot of product and I'm a, um, I forgot the word, but I'm like, um, I don't know. Like I like 
product i like to you know really put it on there um i really i like it i like it i've worn it a few times and i like the way um the finish is um i feel like if you want more product you can kind of just like build it up on your face Sorry guys, I'm I'm like getting ready to go somewhere, so I am like I gotta keep moving with my routine. <laughs> but I like it. I really do like it. Um, I'm gonna come back to show you guys like the final, you know, end product after I like complete my full face. I do think that like I will try to go a shade darker just to see what that looks like. Like my skin tone is really hard to find um foundation matches for it like i think i could probably go a little bit more reddish tone but at the same time i my skin is kind of olive toned so it is really hard for me to find foundation like even when like fenty came out with all those different shades my perfect shade was two shades mixed together i forgot the shades but it, I, I i still use two different colors and i mix them together and then that was like my perfect shade so Yes, it's, it's, it's a little bit harder for me to find my shade. I don't know, my skin tone is like a weird, like, it's like a dark chocolate brown, but it's also like an olive a olive milk chocolate. Like, I can't even explain, guys, but yeah. I definitely like it, and I'm going to come back with my final look to show you guys, like, how it looks with my highlight and contour and everything so and I, you can even see right now like it's starting to oxidize and it's starting to look more like my hey guys okay so i came back just to show you guys what my face looks like after i've done my highlight and contour so not too bad right Okay, I'm going to come back after I've completed my entire face to give you guys a final look. Hey guys! Okay, so I am back with a final look. So I took out my hair pins, as you can see, and I put on my lashes, my highlight blush, and my lippy. And what do you think? I think my makeup look turned out great I think the foundation looks awesome like I think it looks very smooth it looks very skin like um, my skin and my face still feels breathable so honestly I really like the makeup by Mario foundation like the formula is great he did that he ate like I love it um yeah i'm feeling it so let me know your thoughts have you tried makeup by mario foundation have you tried any of his other products i know he has other products but i wanted to just start off with the classic foundation because i've heard so much about it and i'm like i kind of gotta try it for myself like it's been on my list for a long time and when the sale came out came around um when the sephora vib sale came around i'm like okay i'm just gonna treat myself and try it out and i love it like i literally love it especially since like rihanna's um hydrating foundation was discontinued and like i was just using that and then it discontinued and it's like okay now i gotta find another signature foundation and i have been using um born this way which i love born this way um foundation still love it but it is so, so yeah i use Too faced born this way foundation but that foundation is medium to full coverage and it is like medium like i kind of do have to like pack that foundation on to really like get you know what i'm looking for but um yes love makeup by mario i think it's great i highly recommend um neck check it, it's not too bad to me. Let me see. I like it. I think it's fine. So, yes, this is the final look. Thank you so much for watching. Please comment down below and let me know how you like the look. How do you like the foundation? Have you tried the foundation? And if you have any other product recommendations for me, please put that in the comment below. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends, hit the bell notification so that you can receive a notification every time I upload another video. Love you so much. Bye.